Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's my honor to be here uh, to say something about UNESCO Chair on Water, Energy and Disaster Management for Sustainable Development. My name is Kaoru Takara. I'm the chairholder of this Kyoto University UNESCO Chair, WENDY, for short. WENDY stands for Water, Energy and Disaster, as you know. Okay. And, uh, uh, this says uh, something about the history to establishment of WENDY. I was uh, uh, participating in UNESCO International Hydrological Program since 1995. So more than 20 years, uh, more than 20 years, uh, I have experiences with UNESCO matters. And Kyoto University DPRI stands for Disaster Prevention Research Institute. And the DPRI and UNESCO uh, concluded the MOU in 1999. After that, uh, uh, UNESCO Kyoto University ICL, Unity Win Network in Landslide Risk Mitigation, since March 2003. Uh, this was headed by Professor uh, Kyoji Sasa. He is currently the, the Professor Emeritus of Kyoto University, also attending uh, today. And uh, this uh, UNESCO or Kyoto University ICL Intuit Network was uh, denued as landslide and water related disaster risk management since November 2010. Then uh, we, Kyoto University, we concluded a, an MOU between uh, UNESCO and Kyoto University for internship since November 2012. At that time, uh, Director General uh, Idina Bokova came to Kyoto University and she gave us uh, a special lecture on uh, 6th of November 2012. So this uh, is a snapshot at that time with uh, previous uh, our president Hiroshi Matsumoto. And in April 2017, we proposed Wendy's to UNESCO headquarters and the approval no notification came in August 2017, last year. And December last year, we organized international symposium on utilization of field site in research and education, which was called as Free 2017 on 8th and 9th of December 2017. Then uh, this year, February, uh, Dr. Andras Suzorozinagi and uh, uh, Branka uh, Jimenez Cisneros came to Kyoto University with uh, an agreement document uh, with signed uh, by the new uh, Director General of UNESCO and our president signed on this uh, document and uh, uh, we formally he agreed to establish this UNESCO chair Wendy on 13th of February 2018. And our official logo approved in March 2018. Official logo, I mean, is this, this one. UNESCO logo and the Unitwin Networks logo. And here uh, it is said UNESCO Chair on Water, Energy and Disaster Management for Sustainable Development at Kyoto University of Japan. This is the uh, uh, official logo of UNESCO, or for UNESCO Chair. And also we creating another logo for Wendy. This. So this uh, uh, is, uh, indicates water and, and also some energy, explosion of energy or something like that. And also the, the disaster uh, event, uh, explosive some events. Okay. So this is uh, uh, Wendy's logo. And uh, Wendy is a kind of uh, lady's name. So it's very charming, I hope. So I, I hope this uh, UNESCO chair uh, is loved by everybody. And today uh, we are organizing inaugural symposium here. Thank you very much for your all joining this symposium. And today's symposium objectives are to seek to promote dialogue, exchange, and collaboration, including academic research and networking amongst UNESCO chairs and centers. 
And this symposium will also raise the groundwork for expanding and strengthening the academic network for collaboration and exchange in higher education and research between Kyoto University and partner universities and organizations. So we are inviting uh, many distinguished uh, guests from UNESCO headquarters, Dr. Peter Wells. He will be he arriving at lunchtime here from higher education section. And also uh, Dr. Uh, Mohamed Nasir, Mohamed No, who is sitting there. Uh, he is the Director General of the Department of Education and Drainage Malaysia. And other UNESCO uh, centers representative from Malaysia, Poland, Indonesia, and Japan. And also uh, we invited uh, four representatives from uh, UNESCO chairs. Uh, from Slovenia, Kazakhstan, Thailand, and Japan. So we can uh, have uh, their speeches uh, afternoon. And uh, this is why a UNESCO Chair on Water Energy and Disaster Management in Kyoto University. We have many water-related professors in graduate school of science, engineering, agriculture, management, and global environmental studies, etc. And uh, Kyoto University is only one university which has graduate school of energy science. So this is uh, very unique uh, in Kyoto University. And uh, other uniqueness uh, <coughs> is we have uh, various kinds of research institutes, such as research institute, disaster prevention research institute, institute of advanced energy, and the research institute for sustainable human sphere in Uji campus. And other studies, uh, we have Graduate School of Asian and African Area Studies and Center for South Asian S Studies. And uh, I'm belonging to New Graduate School uh, of Advanced Integrated Studies in Human Survivability, GSAIS, so-called Shishukan. So this is uh, the UNESCO Chair Wendy's uh, characteristics uh, located in Kyoto University. And uh, this is one of the examples of uh, UNESCO chair curriculum, water environment, for, for example. Uh, we have many graduate schools and research centers, research institutes, and uh, we, we may uh, systematically uh, arrange uh, the water-related subjects, also subjects on SDGs, and subjects on climate change, and subjects on data sciences. And IHP training course can be uh, one of the uh, curriculum items, and also we will organize field trainings for students. So students can take part in this uh, water environmental course, and uh, they can get uh, UNESCO chair certificate at the end of the, uh, their study. And Kyoto University has uh, uh, about 40 uh, off-campus facilities for research and education, from Hokkaido to uh, Yakushima. Island. And Kyoto University also has uh, uh, 57 overseas research sites. And also uh, Kyoto University professors are uh, implementing Satorepus project. Uh, we have uh, uh, nine locations and 13 uh, Satorepus uh, projects all over the world. And this uh, indicates uh, uh, bureaucratic stru uh, structure of UNESCO. And the UNESCO has director general, and uh, under her, uh, there are education, natural sciences, and social and human sciences, and the cultural uh, sectors, and the uh, foreign freedom of expression and the building knowledge in societies uh, sector. And also, uh, they have. Uh, uh, IOC, International uh, Oceanographic Commission. And uh, UNESCO has uh, 55 field offices. Seven of them are cluster offices, and the national offices, and the uh, regional offices, and the liaison offices. And UNESCO is uh, uh, managing world cultural heritages, world natural heritages, geoparks, and the biosphere reserves. So we, may use of, we will make use of these uh, facilities operated by UNESCO. So this is uh, World Natural Heritage in Japan. Uh, we have uh, uh, 
知床白神山地小笠原アイランド小笠原アイランド屋久島。And also,、uh, we have many geoparks in Japan, and some of them are designated by UNESCO, and others are designated by the Japan Geoparks Com- Committee. And global、uh, geoparks network, and、uh, the, the, there are、uh, Japanese geoparks and、uh, many other、uh, geoparks all over the world. And UNESCO chair、uh, d e a l with、uh, water related disaster risk reduction and water resource management and water quality and、uh, energy, food and forestry and biodiversity. And the climate change is a cross cutting issue and also data science is also、oh, cross cutting issues. So we have such、uh, eight components. And we are、uh, going to have.、Uh, Some links with governmental bodies and international organizations and、uh, research institutions and international initiatives and programs. And、uh, many of the Kyoto University graduate schools and the research institutes and centers are supporting, to,、uh, supporting this UNESCO chair. So,、uh, the UNESCO chair、uh, would like to establish Kyoto University model for education for sustainable de- development. Actually, higher education for、uh, higher education and research for sustainable development, so called HESD. Okay, this is my introduction about our UNESCO chair,、uh, and uh, uh, I hope you enjoy、uh, today's talks、uh, by UNESCO co chairs, UNESCO chair co chairs, and also UNESCO centers and UNESCO、uh, chairs representatives in the afternoon. Thank you very much for your kind attention. <laughs>